Right. Next one is... Uh... Is everywhere. I just... <laughs> Um, I feel like it's... Oh, I forgot. I think in the original game it was X to gallop, and it's triangle now. I might be wrong, but I keep wanting to press X for some reason. Um, yeah, I think it's this way. No? <laughs> it most certainly isn't. It is, in fact, uh, over that way. Okay. See, so yeah, this is... This is a difficult one, but not in a way that it will kill you, or at least it probably won't. I'm not saying it's impossible to die to it, but the odds are it's more just going to be a time thing than a it's going to kill you because it's really hard kind of thing. So, brace yourself for that. You're going to be here for a while. This is one that can very easily catch you off guard. Again, it's not really because it's difficult, it's just because it's... you will probably fall off <laughs> at least once. Just just on... just by odds. But yeah, I think this way we, we have to travel quite a bit to get to this one. So we get to spend like five minutes reflecting on the uh, the previous Colossus, which was a bitch. I, <laughs> I, just, that, I, I don't think I've ever had so much trouble getting it to find me. It, like, it's usually not supposed to be that difficult. It's supposed to just be like, oh, okay, you've attacked me. I'm gonna go and see where you are now. And it just really didn't want to. Um, so if you see sections like that, they're basically shrines, but that's usually where you'll probably find a lizard tail. Probably. Yes, it's in this way. Uh, that's usually where you'll find one. There's a lizard there, but it doesn't have a white tail. If it has a white tail, that's the one you're after. I'm assuming it's through here. I mean, it's... Yes, it is. It's created a nice path for us, so I presume so. Ah, right, don't worry. You won't be coming with us. Because this is a water one. Or is it? Yes, it is. Or is it? Yes. Or is it? What if I told you it wasn't? Oh my god. But we're above water. Oh, did I just give it away by saying above water? Accidentally, yes. Yes, I did. <laughs> it's a plane. No, it's Superman. Wait, no, it's the other one. What is it? That's right, a bird. It's a flamingo. Hope you're ready for giant flamingo. My favourite colossus. The flamingo hide. Good, good flamingo. Good, good, fl good fling. Good fling. It might fling me about, actually. It almost certainly will. Look at that flamingo, there it is. On its zero legs. Yep, there it is. It's fucking awesome to look at, though. does have legs. Well, well, more talons, I guess, but... Yes. <laughs> Water. That would probably hurt quite a bit, actually. So, yes. The reason this one is so hard is because you are going to be grabbing onto it whilst it's flying, and you have to... It, it's going to do some aerial turns, and it's going to make sure it tries to fling you off any way it knows how. You are almost certainly going to fall off this thing. Now, it's not a difficult boss. But you're going to be here a while. <laughs> so get used to that. If it's your first time playing this, yeah, you, you're going to get... Not stuck, you just... You're going to fall off. It's going to happen. So just give it time. Hello! How are you doing? I come bearing gift. It's an arrow to the face. You seem real happy about this. Oh shit, wrong one! Well, that was unfortunate. 
it's usually not that unlucky. It usually comes for you. So that was surprising. Where is it? It's going back for round two. Go! Okay, we're good. So I assume you've seen where the two parts of it I need to kill are. That's right, the wings. Crazy, right? On a bird. The wings on a bird. The wings on a butterfly. Oh no. Oh no. Well, that was lucky. We got it really easily. But that's the problem. We've got more than one of them. It has two wings, you see. I know. Birds having more than one wing? How could it possibly be? It's just like Mother Nature intended. Actually, that's exactly what it is. Now, if you want to be brave, you can try and let go and see if you can thrust yourself in towards where you need to be. Uh, and at some point, you're going to have to try and risk it because you are going to run out of stamina. Um, even though you've been given more, believe um, it won't be enough. You know what? That was really lucky. I'll get the one down here and regain my stams. Yeah, this one is the easiest one by far. Because unless he wants to do something like turn around, he doesn't really stop you from doing anything here. Which is nice. Also, kind of bad in some ways. Right. So now we've got to get to the other wing without falling off. Easier said than done, I know. I also love that you move slower trying to get back because of the momentum of just the wind pushing you. Just really nice, really nice touch. Really nice touch. Just It's the little things like that which just really make this game even better than it already is. And it is already a bloody good game! Oh my god! Go. Please go. Okay, right. We're holding on to something. I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk it. Yes! Oh my god, it worked. Wait, what? That is very unfortunate. <laughs> I don't really know what happened there, if I'm being honest. I don't even know where the platforms are. I was so close to doing that perfectly. I can't believe it. I, I'm i mildly sad, but I'm also fine because I'm not dead. So it's all good. Thumbs up for me. Where are the platforms I need to get to anyway? I think they are those ones over there. So I hope so, because that's where I'm going. <laughs> it appears to be the direction I'm heading, so if it isn't there, whoopsie, I guess. No idea where it is. Oh, it's up there. I think I have to shoot it with an arrow before it's uh, gonna come at me. It's not just gonna notice me and be like, Oh yeah, I'm gonna go for you, because it worked so well the first time. No, it's gonna have to take damage. I wonder if you can kill it with an arrow though. Like, if you reduce it so much, then you fire one arrow and it just hits its mark. Oh, he's mad. Oh, he certainly is mad. How's this gonna go, I wonder? Is he going to try and thrust me with his mighty... Mighty wing? Oh, he's even being kind and giving me the right side, I think. Go! Yep, I'm on the right side. So that's handy. Thank you. Thank you, Birdman. It's Eagle Man! I've got something. For you. Wow, look at those low rates. Oh my god. Yay, there's an arrow underneath it floating forever in the abyss. We did it. And there I go. <laughs> Fine, don't worry about it. Perfectly fine. Whew. Well, what a, what a good day it is. What a fantastic day indeed. Lovely water area, isn't it? Lovely time to be alive. 
They're coming for me. I should probably run. In the smoke, it spells the words "fuck you." <laughs> it doesn't, but that would be very funny. All right, let's take down number six. Is, if number six is the one I think it is, it, it's a good one. I like this one. It is. Oh, it's the one that was that way. It was six all along. I never knew, technically speaking. I knew there was one this way. I just didn't know which one. But now I do. What a joyous time to be alive. So this way, right? Yep, that seems to be the case. Seems to be very much this way. I don't know if I'm actually going the right way here. There might be another path further along. Or it might be this way indeed. Soon find out. Oh, actually, is this the one that is not misleading, but just difficult to find. Because, like, when you get close-ish, the, uh, the light just, like, dissipates into yellow just to suggest, oh, you're close, go and find it, kind of thing. Um, and it's very much not clear where you actually have to go for it. Uh, this, I don't think is the one. The forest is always difficult to traverse, because one, aggro is really slow because he cares about the environment. Um, and two, you don't know where you're going through these woods the first time. Yeah. Odds are you're a little lost. Yeah. Yeah. Go faster. Yeah. But, but Agro won't go faster. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder if this game's gonna ever get like future patches or something. The game does have more than um, yeah. than the original release. There's 79, I want to say 79 coins scattered throughout the world, and no map to find them, just find all coins. They're hidden very, very, very well. Um, and once you get them all, the secret room unlocks, and you get a thing. Um, and it's very cool that they actually did that, because they didn't have to at all. But it's, it's very cool that they added a thing. I can understand why they didn't add another Colossus, because originally... The game was supposed to have, I think, 48 Colossus, which you might be thinking is a lot. In fact, three times the amount the game actually has. And you're right, it is. That's probably why it didn't happen. <laughs> I don't think the PS2 could do it, I, not to be honest. I mean, the game's incredible, and I love it with all my soul, but there's just the PS2 back in the day could only do so much. And yes, you could make them all for the PS4, sure, but that's not what it's about, really, is it? Yeah. It's about remastering a classic, not expanding the classic. It's about making it theoretically better, and making more won't necessarily make it better. Improving what it looks like, to a degree, does. So, I mean, it's it's all about working out what you really want out of a remaster. Like, Crash and Spyro is a completely different ball game. Because, like, you can remaster this, and it doesn't really add much. You can remaster Crash and Spyro, and technically speaking, it still doesn't really add much. But it's about what it represents. And what it represents is a franchise, or a set of franchises, that shouldn't have died out being reborn and being brought back into the spotlight in a way that it never was. Well, I'd, I'd say it never was is probably an understatement, but it's certainly very, very popular again in a way that I don't think anyone was expecting. It, it was always going to be a popular comeback, but it just blew up, and that's fantastic. Um... So, yeah, it's about, it's more about what that represents than anything, I think, personally. But, hey-ho, Colossus number six.
This one's fun. I like this one. There's a great big bushy beard! That's a reference for you. One of my favourite movies of all time. Oh dear. <laughs> that didn't quite go how I envisioned. I was trying to let go, and it sort of propelled me off way further than I wanted to be. So that's a bad start already. But don't worry, we'll recover. You, re you do regain health over time, you may have noticed that. Uh, and it is true, you do. And that's where I'm going to survive, I guess. Also, hi. Here it is. Here's the big boy. Run. Run fast. A little bit faster if you can. Ah, oh, it's doing damage. The good thing, actually, I think that healed me during the cutscene. That's very, very generous, and I did not know that. Technically speaking, makes sense for how the game works. Like, like cutscenes usually treat the game as, oh, the game is stationary in that time. You're not losing health, you're not constantly being hit or whatever, blah, blah, blah. But you are. Like, it's just a cutscene. You're still, things are still happening. So actually, it's kind of good if it does work that way. I like that. Again, the little touches. Always very nice to see. Run still. You should still be running if you have not noticed. So you want to get in here for uh, for reasons that will become very clear soon. Look, here's me shooting at you. It's fun. Try me, mate. I'm ready for you. Go for it. Come on, try me. I dare you. That, I wasn't expecting, actually. I was expecting you to do something completely different. That wasn't what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to check me out, boy! Like so. Look at this beard. Magnificent thing, isn't it? I'm gonna climb it because it is my destiny. It's a tasty looking beard. You've got some piercings. Nice man. Not a massive piercing guy myself, but but I you know not something I feel like I ever want to have on me. Probably doesn't help that I'm, you know, scared of needles, so like I know it's not a needle, but it is a sharp thing being pierced through you. I, I feel like that that's not really gonna help, but I've been told it doesn't really hurt, so then again, how's that? But, I don't know, it's just not me, it's not my style. I don't mind people with them though, some people can really just be, look super badass with it. Super badass or super cute, depending on who you are, and how you, how you do it, how you do. You do you. Like, at the end of the day, no one's opinion but your, yours really matters about how you look, and how you dress, and how you act. And, like, Obviously, stay within the confines of the law, but, like, whatever you do beyond that, like, just whatever you want to do. Like, generally be nice to people, but just, just dress, act however you want. It's your life. You wanna, you wanna get a mohawk? You get that mohawk, you will look super cool with it. You wanna, you wanna be an excellent gaming geek? Then you be a gaming geek. People will love you for it. Do whatever you want. That's what life's about. Again, within the confines of the law. Uh, I forget where the next one is, to be honest. Uh, fortunately, the sword reveals all if you have time. Oh, I found it. <laughs> ne never mind. I found where I need to go. I'm not going to lie. That was an absolute accident, but I'm not going to argue it. It was pretty good. Do it. Okay, there we go. Come on, two more to do it. Two more big stabs. Ah! Big stab, come on. Big stab, let's go. Cha-cha real smooth. No! No! Okay, one more. Come on. We got this. There it is. Yeah, we did it! 
Number six is down. Not bad, making good progress. Our current pace, under four hours or so, maybe? Assuming some bosses don't absolutely take forever, like a certain horse boss. That, that took way too long, but oh wells. To be fair, I'm not that mad. Like, I don't really care. <laughs> but still, it did take a while, didn't it? Look, there are six... Oh, we can't even skip this yet. There are six towering over us. I wonder if this means I cannot skip. Fine, I won't skip it then. Now I will skip it. Explodey. I don't know why sometimes it has to load a little bit more, but... The next Colossus must be huge! I mean, it might be, I don't really remember. You can grab onto the birds. I nearly did it that time. It was pretty cool. Oh! Yeah, gotcha! Bird! Then it crashes into a wall and you let go. But bird! You can grab onto bird. I like grabbing onto birds. I also like this, when you're near the shrine he actually kneels. That's that's a nice touch. I like that. I like that a lot. But uh yes, I think that'll end it for this session. Where's the next one for the next session? The next one is oh, you are way over that way. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs>